Monday is the day before Valentine's Day. Now, if you're like me, you don't really like to spend that much money on Valentine's Day. I know, I know. I'm lame and blah, 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 and all that other junk. But I really don't like to spend that much money on Valentine's Day. I also don't like to fight the crowd on Valentine's Day. But you know what? This year we're gonna do something a little bit different. I'm gonna take Shay on a Valentine's Day. But there is gonna be a stipulation. As you know, we are on a journey to save money, to pay off some debt, to maybe buy a house, all these things. We have so many plans and we've had these goals to save money. So in order for us to have a Valentine's date, we are actually gonna use our spare change. Now, we keep a spare change jug. I don't know if you guys have one or not, but we do. We have cash, we take that extra change, we get change, we just throw it in there, and we've had it for a year or so, maybe. Um, and we really don't have that much cash on us, so there's not a lot in there, I don't think, but that's what we're gonna do. We are going to count the change, and then whatever money we have in that jug, we are able to spend that on Valentine's Day. So if it's a nice dinner or a lunch and maybe a gift, dessert, an event, I don't know. It depends on the money on there. I mean, it could be any of those or it could be a Costco hot dog, honestly. I'm gonna change you half in your nooks and crannies. Now we're using the dimes. And the quarter. Oh, yeah. okay. I'll buy new ones when I need to. Okay. Hang on, I got, I got some change. Oh, there's another penny. Don't. Don't expose my bag. <laughs> so this is our pickle jar. With our Crown Royal bag. Crown Royal bag. If you know, you know. You even got the cute peach one. Yep. I'm gonna go have a real nice dinner at Ohana. <sighs> Or are we going to Costco to get hot dogs and a piece of pizza? I have a new hoodie. No, I'm probably not going to have enough money for that. I but who knows? How much do you think in there? Uh, I'm going to say 75 bucks. Why do you take my guess? I was going to say 70. Okay, let's count. You ready? Oh, God. Oh, it's kind of heavy. So Valentine's Day. Three, four, four, five, six, seven, four, eight, four, nine, 50. 50. I just said 50. So let's assume with this, this is what we haven't counted yet. Or do you want to count it? Uh -huh. You got to do 100 pennies for a dollar. So you're going to want to count it or do you want to just guesstimate five bucks? You think that's five dollars? I don't think it's five dollars. So do you want to count it? I just want to count it because I want to know. Okay. So we're at 50 right now, right? Loose change in the car and looking in her sock drawer, going through her purse, trying to get everything she can. Four and a half. Okay. So 54. And 50 cents. Oh, and then we have the 60 right there. So. 55. $55. All right, so we're not gonna go out tomorrow because one, we have Sunny's class. We have to take her to school. She has Damn school tomorrow. Kids. Two, it's gonna be super busy out tomorrow. It's gonna be packed. People are gonna be at restaurants. People are gonna be out and about. And I'm trying to go where I wanna go without a wait time. Exactly. So we're actually gonna end up probably doing this, what, Wednesday or Thursday? The day after or Thursday. So that's when we're gonna actually do that. But this is our Valentine's Day. We usually don't do too much anyways for Valentine's Day. But because we're actually saving money and trying to do all these things, we thought it'd be fun to take our change jar, our pickle jar, and make a date out of this. Mm -hmm. 
get a little creative and enjoy it. But I mean, fifty-five dollars, not the seventy-five dollars that we wish we had. But fifty-five dollars, and we can probably a lot more than other people keep saving their change. Oh, for sure, especially nowadays, people probably don't have change at all. I love change. She loves change, but so we're gonna take this, go get the dollars, and then figure out what we're doing with, and we can only spend this. This dinner tip, whatever, only coming out of this. We are heading out for our Valentine's date night, and then as you remember, the stipulation is, is we have to use only our change. So our plan is we're gonna go get some food. We were gonna go bowling, but they're gonna have leagues all night thursday so we cut that out we're probably gonna do that sunday plus it's like quarter a game or something like that something crazy huh i think it was like i think you're a little like three dollars uh, three dollars probably game. like three dollars or something yeah. like that but it's a lot cheaper going on a sunday so i think sunday would be nice so we're gonna get some food and then the for sure thing is we're gonna get dessert at rivoli's this is one of our favorite dessert spots here in Ogden. So if you're in this area, I would definitely check them out for desserts. What? Taking our change and our Crown Royal bag. Don't mind our house, it's a mess. Yeah. This week has been out of control. Date night. Gotta, Gotta clean, clean the car. While. Gotta clean the car. Cost? Membership. $0. <laughs> Zero dollars out of the fifty-five dollars that we have to spend because this is a membership that we have. Utah is a must. All right, they salt the roads during the winter, and it gets all over your car. If you don't wash your car during the winter, you're gonna get rust. So it's just as bad as living by the ocean, honestly. I think we get salt everywhere. You gotta wash your car. You gotta have a membership in Utah. I know people are like, it's winter, why would you wash your car? No, wash your car in the winter, for sure. Now we're gonna get our dessert. And then we'll see where we're at with money after that. But it's also very cold out here. Oh, you could see mine. All right, here we go. All right, here it is. What is this, Oreo cheesecake? Oreo cheesecake from Ravoli's. This is our favorite dessert place in Ogden. As of right now, we have we still got some places to try, obviously, but this is our go-to. This is where we love to get our cakes from, pies, everything in Ogden. There's some great places in Salt Lake too, but if you're in the Ogden area, 25th Street, this is it. So let's try this out. So I think we're out of money. I think that was... We watched a great game at the, at the bar. Mm -hmm. So that was an event. We had good food, and now we get dessert. Mm -hmm. All right, fifty-five dollar Valentine's date night. I think this is going to be a thing to get the change to save our change, and then every year we just go off of the change. Okay. okay. All right. Was was a success, I believe. So yeah. All right, we're gonna finish this or eat a few bites of this, and then go to bed. So. Thank you for watching. You guys have a wonderful night. Hope your Valentine's was amazing. If you were solo, I still hope it was amazing. I hope you went out and, you know, spoiled yourself. So we will see you around town.